What's going on guys, it's your boy JP here and today I'm going to be showing you how to use your iPod Touch, iPhone and iPad as your remote control for Kodi. Now before we get started, if you're running on a PC, you're going to want to download the Apple Bonjour service. That way you can actually run your uh, Apple device here. Uh, if you're on an Android device, you don't have to, but this video is only on an I iOS device. So uh, before that, the drivers, the links are going to be down below in the description so you guys can do that if you're running on a PC. Now, if you're running on uh, Android TV box or any Fire Stick or any anything like that, uh, you should be fine without installing anything. So let's get right into the video. I'm going to be showing you where you're going to be getting the... Uh, app first you're going to go into the app store and then we're going to be searching for the official Kodi remote go ahead and search that app once you search that app it's going to be the first one go ahead and install it once you install it you're going to get this little app right here uh, but before we get into the app we're going to go on our Kodi uh, like again if you're running this on a PC there's some different things that you're going to have to do but if you're running on an Android TV box and anything Android you're going to go to system and then we're going to be uh, going to services and at the bottom here what it says set, uh, settings level you want to change that to expert once you do that go to the web server and allow remote control via http go ahead and uh, check that off and then go to remote control click uh, on take this one the top and the bottom one as well once you do that you can go to the app on the on your iphone or ipad or ipad i mean iphone ipod or ipad and then you're going to want to go to the at host as you can see there i already have some there because i have one of my boxes there and i have one of and i have my pc as well so you're going to go and click on at host here you're going to be uh, if everything is running well if you have your if you already take the allow to uh remote control via http you don't have to type anything here uh, you don't have to put a username or password but i suggest you do for the matter of this uh, tutorial i'm not going to do that but anyways once you do that if everything is open you can click find cody and it's going to find whatever it's open and running right now so right now my android tv boxes are all off i have three but i only have one connected to my iphone they're they're all off but my pc is on so as you can see there it says cody pc that's because i named my cody on my pc Cody PC uh, but as you can see here it gives you a bunch of uh, details about the connection that's pretty much it once you do that you can just click save and then you'll see the uh, the it'll add it to the main menu if you want to connect to it you click on it and it's gonna it's gonna connect to you good you'll get a couple of options here at the side you, but uh, the one that I use is the remote control you can play with it as you will so I'm gonna go ahead and get out of this with my mouse for now but as you can see here, I'm going to start using the remote control on my iPhone. It's going to start moving it on the Kodi, as you can see there. And you can press uh, anything here. I like it. It's really nice. It's really neat. I thought I would, sh I would show you this, guys. Uh, but if you're running on a PC, you're going to want to go into System, Services, and then we're going to be going into a Zero Comfort which is this one uh, and then you're going to have to uh, enable the one at the top but before you do that you're going to you're not going to be able to do it if you d don't have the apple uh bonjour services so you're going to have to download that first and check that and then you're going to go into the airplay and enable it and that's pretty much it hope this uh, video helped you guys if it didn't if you find if you have any troubles just leave a comment down below in the description and i'll make sure to get back to you as soon as possible i'll see you guys in my next video Peace.